Welcome to Reanimator Reviews. I'm Rayanne, and today I'm going to talk about Body Melt. So this is an Australian film from the 90s. I will put all the director info and release date in the box down below. A corporation called Vimuville, I believe, is testing its nutritional supplements on the unknowing uh, residents of Pebbles Court. And not, not a lot of this stuff is pretty safe, as we find out. Um, the movie opened with, it looks like the head scientist and dude trying to derail her and expose her, getting all this information to go make it, you know, publicly, publicly known and to let the residents that are being tested on know exactly what's going on. She injects him with a crap load of an unknown substance that we assume is in the nutritional supplement. And on his way to get there, he then starts to have his body melt, as the title would suggest. He made it as far as to be chased by police and then uh, jettisoned through his windshield as he starts to feel the effects and record it on his handheld recorder thing that we never see anymore because everyone has, you know, an Android or an iPhone. The 90s. Um, the police start to investigate who he is, who this company is, as we still watch them gather information on each resident, a pregnant woman and her husband, a family with a father who's very fanatical about jogging and wearing really weird outfits, and uh, some brothers. And I'll kind of leave it off there. What did I like about this movie? It was disgusting. It was so disgusting. I can't handle, like, phlegmy, ugh. Like, it just turns my stomach so much. It made me think a lot of, um, quite a few scenes from, uh, Peter Jackson films in particular, which I believe this is inspired by, like, the filmmakers were inspired by this. Uh, like, a lot of stuff in Dead Alive. That was just gross for gross sake. I love it. The effects were done really well. The actual body melting effects in particular were executed really well. I felt like the lingering shots on them were appropriate to get the perfect degree of disgust out of your audience. Good job. I like that the story was multifaceted. It went into a bit about the guy pioneering the um, supplements and a partner that he spurned who obviously wants revenge in some way or the other. It's real weird stories with him and his family. Um, I thought the pacing was really good. I didn't feel like it took a long time to get from like point to point to point. It flowed really nicely and it kept me really entertained. My dislikes. There's a scene with some inferred animal cruelty, which I really, like, that makes me sound like the worst person in the world, that you're literally melting all these people, but then you kill a kangaroo, and I'm like, this is unacceptable. But I like animals a whole lot. Animals are really nice, nice creatures. You can't say that for a lot of people, unfortunately. There are good people, but there's also a lot of crappy people, but there aren't a lot of crappy animals. That's just how it is. Um, yeah, I feel like that and some of the dialogue was a bit hard to hear just because I'm not a native Australian. So it was a, some of it I was like, what? what? Like, I, I didn't get some of the slang, but that's me being a dumb American. That's fine. I don't care. I still enjoyed it. It was a good watch. I will give this like a solid 3.5 out of 5. I think it is worth a watch. I had a very good time watching it. My stomach hurt really bad watching certain parts because they're disgusting. That's the movie. So I found this, I think it was on Amazon Prime streaming video. I will put in the box down below if there are any other platforms you could find it streaming. If it is available in physical copy, we'll put that down below. Um, have you guys seen this movie? What were your thoughts? I'm kind of bummed 
that I didn't know up until this point that this movie even existed because nobody talks about it. And I don't know if it's, you know, the trend seems to be just talking about really popular, newly released movies. Why did no one talk about this movie? Why did it take me to this point in my life to know about this movie? Because it is awesome. But leave me your thoughts down below. If you haven't already, please do subscribe to the channel. I'd love to have you. Hit the bell for all notifications of my further uploads and live streams. If you'd like to, you can follow me on Facebook at Reanimator Reviews and Twitter and Instagram at Reanimator. And have a good body melt, y'all.